farming and creating olive oil is not an easy job. It's something you should do with really, really a lot of passion. My name is Paolo Boeri and I'm part of the Roy olive oil family. Roy is known for making olive oil from a local olive called Tajasca. We are in northwest Italy, near the border of France, in a village called Badalucco. I am the fifth generation olive miller. My great-grandfather Giuseppe started the business in 1890. The town of Badalucco sits in the middle of Valle Argentina. The economy of the valley has been based on the olive trees and oil since 1600. The mix between the mountain and the sea is what gives the Tajasca olive its special flavor. You can use Tajasca oil to cook with, but it's best use it as finishing oil. Its gentle, balanced flavor will never overpower the food. Harvesting is a very difficult job that takes up to three months of working every day to harvest olives when they are ripe. We start by unrolling a 4 meters by 160 meter net. We sew each of these together to form one continuous net from the top of the hill to the bottom. This prevents any fruit to being lost when we harvest the trees. We start at the top of the mountain shaking the branches with electric and tools called sbattitori to get the olives of the trees. Someone gets under the nets and pushes the olive from terrace to terrace where they ultimately get loaded into boxes and onto the tractor. From there, the olives drive down the mountain to the mill where they get sorted, cleaned and milled within 24 hours of picking. We crush a majority of our olives with a classic stone mill, but utilize more modern machine for olives at a certain maturity. The paste produced by the machine gets loaded with the flat filters, called sportin. The fully loaded cart is moved to the press, where it's slowly compressed until 98% of the liquids are extracted. The oil and water mixtures get sent to the centrifuge, the lighter oil separates from the water and pours out into a holding tank. When a customer places an order, we bottle the oil at the time to ensure maximum freshness and flavor. We are very fortunate that our products have been very well received by some of the greatest restaurants and chefs in Italy and the rest of the world as well. At Roy, we are very excited about the future and where the olive might take us. I think if my grandfather was able to see where Roy is today, he would be very proud. He would be very happy to see how the brand has grown, but mostly to see that the family is still working together each day.